welcome back guys to another EU4 uh, Germany campaign. So I was just taking a look at the world map and yeah a lot of stuff is missing on this map uh, mostly over here in the Americas. I'm surprised by how little colonization that has been going on. So yeah like even even here in Africa you don't see any of the European powers really. You got England down here, then Castile over there, and that's about it. And I mean you got them a few over here, and oh, Aragon's actually over here too. That's actually kind of surprising to see Aragon. But yeah, I mean, very few little has happened. Alright, we thought we could do a whole colonization campaign as Germany, but well, I don't know. Um, right now, we do have a wall going on that we were supporting, but uh, we're just going to let uh, Poland beat the heck out of Muscovy at this point. Um, the whole reason why we got into it is because at one point, Poland did not have a heir, and uh, one of our heirs could have came up to the throne, which would have been very beneficial on our part, but no, that did not happen. Um, I am looking here at the uh, uh, college, Co college. I don't know how to pronounce that, but his name 100%. Um, I think going to war with him would be a very good move. He has two very weak allies, and he does control does control a province we want. Um, we all also at the time trying to make uh, Munster like us better. Let's go ahead and get these two forts uh, besieged. So yeah, a lot, a lot is happening right now. And once again, rebels. Uh, they're broken. They'll finish separatists, but they're uh, bohemian rebels. Not Bohemian, um, Bulgarian rebels. I don't get why I keep wanting to call uh, Burgundy Bohemia. Could not tell you. Uh, but we all are 73% uh, of the way of uh, annexing Bohemia. So once that happens, that will be awesome. Um, we are on the edge of having unbalanced um, technology. And actually, we are falling behind in technology everywhere right now. Uh, that is not good. Um, so, what are we going to do about this? Really, we need we need a better uh, king. I I see your three one. That's yeah. That's pretty bad. Like this three five four is much better. I oh what? Oh no 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 no. You are not. You are not doing such thing. Why? Why do you? That would be why they want those lands, but they are mine. No, you, you can't leave. I refuse you to leave. Rivaled Poland, you idiots. You are a idiot. Uh, 
let's get the tax modifier guy. Oh my god, game. This game does not want me to have a good leader. to try and go after Netherlands now. Oh. Can we like just piece out of this wall? Probably should have give all this land to to him before we left. But, but oh well. Okay, um annexing you. Alright, we can't really double annex. You take five years. Hold on. When does your annexation end? February. And when does when will it end? July. Um. Well, let's let's leave it for now. Okay. So we we are missing. Well, we no longer have a, a alliance with you. Which is sad. Um. So our warrior mode is kind of pointless. It will eventually break away. And our coalition apparently. Okay, um, let's go ahead and declare this wall. It is literally going to be a one two hit. <laughs> Bohemia, uh, no, Bohemia does not have a claim on that. That's interesting. So, yeah, I'm not quite sure how we are still the Emperor. <laughs> um, probably because we had it for such a long time. Let me guess. 
this under control? Yep. Under control. Um, falling now. Oh, hold on, wait, no. No. Oh, you're in Postal Union with... Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, no. I'm not quite sure what I want to do for Peace Office just yet. Bump that back up. Okay, now we want to vassalize this guy because those four four pieces of land we can get for him. Go deal with that guy. Go ahead and just fight PCU. There's, there's nothing you have that we want. What about you? Are you willing to do peace out? No. Not at all. Fine, we'll accept your demands. Are these guys independent then? People for the glorious um, Jomen. Oh, you can take care of that for email. Okay, um, let's improve. Well, let's grab a more marriage with you. And then we will improve our relationship with you. Um, let's see, Annex December. Um, yeah, that's gonna be after Bohemia, so that's fine, even though I wanted to try and time it with Bohemia. Hold on, what? Why are you disloyal all of a sudden? Yeah, go, go back, go 
back into our thumb. Stop that. Okay, so right now we're losing three duple power per month, which is not ideal. Um, why do the burgers have a coup happening? Okay, they no longer do. Okay, can't do that. Most likely can't do you guys are. Or you. Yeah. Okay. Bad Bohemia. Alright, let's make you happy. So yeah, yeah. Uh take care of those for those guys. Oddity CG. Let's get out of there. I could kill us. Sorry, truth. Eventually, also be under one banner. <laughs> Yeah, like we could go to war with you now and you. You're allied to Austria though. You're uh, wow, you all you're allied to a lot of people. We could just straight up vassalize this guy. It wouldn't be an aggressive expansion either. Um... I think we we should do that. I mean, yeah, it's gonna put us even further down on that, but we, we need this, we want to vassalize this guy. Let's royal marriage you. And then improve relationships, and then we will facilize. Hey, look, new air. Wait, why do we have internal conflict? Uh, boost it, fine. Try and get rid of this. Okay, so. We're actually starting to be powerful enough that people are willing to be vassalized by us. be nice if like these guys would let us vassalize them So, Poland, you're all integrating oh, oh, Lithuania, right? That's something I saw. Yeah. April of 6044. Oh, we can take an idea. But. Actually, that would finish that idea. Let's do it. I know it's not ideal, but...
we don't if we took the military tech now we would be behind behind on diplo deck uh, diplo tech mm. which right now with us annexing two two people while losing diplo power so but that's so end in about like three years. Probably not the best choice we just did, but I think we'll be fine. Yes, yes, I think we'll be fine. What, two for two years, um, 36 months. So yeah, actually we're perfectly fine. We're just gonna spend about 72 Diplo power. Oh yeah, we're, we're perfectly fine. You were gonna be November. Okay, August. You've actually gone up. Hmm. Alrighty, so. Wow, Riga. Oh, oh, Sweden's big. Sweden is now big again. <laughs> but Sweden feels threatened by us. That's, that, that's 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Okay, so we can bump this little guy up some more. Actually, how many cannons do you guys have? I guess I only have nine cannons. Hmm. So, yep. If you add two more to you guys. Uh, working on cleaves to be able to vassalize them for free. Um, let's stop that and get a alliance. Uh, one point. Uh, one point. Just one point. Oh, that sucks. So after May 19th, we will uh, pull back. Okay, actually, let's pull him back now. Yep. Yep, now we have a free guy. <laughs> Uh, kind of late for that, Cleaves. <laughs> Bohemia. Stop. Stop it. Let's 
we call this guy and this demand some unlawful territory. Now who are you allied with? You are allied with Austria and Portugal. It's not all that scary. Austria is not scary. He's like small. Um, actually, who do you have war with? Well, you're trying to take that. I know, let's wait until we finish um, annexing Bohemia. It looks like, how, how close are we? March now, because of their stupid shenanigans. And what about you? August, okay. So they're relatively close, but I don't know, do we really want to wait a whole two years? Actually, it really depends on when these go away. So, oh, yeah, never mind, he's gonna have control of these for a while. Because I at least wait till his war is over. Because because this is controlled by the Palatinate, we can't go and demand it. So we're gonna put a cut in the video here, and in the next one, we will hopefully see the annexation of Bohemia, and we will continue our rampage through the HRE. Until then, you guys do take care.